Hey guys, this is Majur and uh, welcome back to my channel. So I have been requested to do my current skincare routine and um, here we go. So as soon as I wake up in the morning, I brush my teeth and I wash my face with this purity cleanser from Philosophy. And I got this huge bottle from 30% off which they come up with one or twice probably uh, during a year and I stock up on this so I have pretty much this amount left and maybe two more months out of it and then I use my moisturizer of my choice from Sunday Riley and this is the skin adrenaline for uh, combination to oily skin and this is being been a lifesaver for my skin and it made my skin super super smooth and luminous if I am not wearing any makeup just skin so basically my skin bounce the light off so this is pretty much a very very good moisturizer although it's very costly I got it from the skinstore.com uh, this is pretty pricey for uh, just 1.7 fluid ounce but I can buy it again in a heartbeat because this is amazing amazing moisturizer for my skin and then I use Paula's Choice uh, Hydrolyte uh, with SPF 30 on my skin because I usually go out for walks and uh, this I use as an SPF for my for my face and uh, why I use it because it is um, what do you call it physical sunscreen in it because all chemical sunscreens are breaking uh, were breaking me out so I choose um, the SPF for my face which are which have titanium titanium ti sorry titanium oxide and zinc oxide in it so and this one is great so and last uh, for my eye cream I'm using this uh, this is the Sisley eye and lip contour gel cream and this is just like plain um, gel Sorry. see just watery gel and I have not made a dent in it no, not that you can tell properly but uh, I have been using more than a month now but and still on the lid there is pretty much there so, not that I have any issues around my eyes but so that I cannot tell you any much difference uh, while I'm using this but it feels very cold and it settles around my eyes pretty much quick and instant and it's just amazing so okay so after that I go out about my day for whatever I have to do and then when I shower later in the day I use um, sorry oh, I use the again the philosophy exfoliating wash uh, this I use this is I use almost daily um, just for my face everybody knows about it so this is the micro micro delivery exfoliating wash of for my face and after that hmm after that I use uh, this SK2 um, the facial treatment essence I have heard great reviews about it so I just started uh, using it I didn't use that much uh, I, I think you can see it um, I can't tell you much about it I don't think as far as I have used it it's making any difference in my skin tone but I'll keep using it and will keep you updated on it we'll see um, after some time if I have any thing more to add to it so far it's just a pretty water or I can say just a toner and I don't use it as a toner also I just splash it on my face as it's as it says and pat it uh, pat it all around so so far so good so let's see and then I uh, 
use okay these this is the new line I've been adding to my routine to skincare routine this is just past month I bought it this is the skin suticles Floritine CF with a broad range and these has antioxidants in it to protect even though if you are not wearing um, um, SPF even though you still have to wear it but it still it settles into your layers of skin and protects it from UVA and UVB rays and it stays in your skin for a minimum of three days so even though you wash out wash your face uh, it still protects your skin so this is the Floritin CF is for oily skin tones and the CE Ferulic is for a drier skin tones so so okay so this is comes with a dropper and uh, see uh, this comes usually as clear liquid but as you have opened it it turns in a yellowish tinge and uh, they says like it will turn to a little bit of a darker yellow tone as uh, because it's starting to oxidize so but by that time uh, you will finish it so this is very very good and these this is the second one on top I use it after it dries on my skin give it a few seconds and then I use the B5 skin suitical B5 hydrating gel um, this is to enhance the moisture in your skin it has vitamin B5 and this is this is just a gel this is the same thing this is more of a gel consistency it feels it it is kind of liquidy as you can see but it has it is when you apply it on your face it is more of a gel texture than the Floritin CF that is more liquidy so these two uh, and this these two have come in a set and I got it from skin so a uh, skin store uh, dot com I will la leave the link in the description box below um, and on top of it I use my SPF of choice this is from the skin suticles uh, physical fusion UV defense sunscreen for SPF 50 and this is also a physical that's why I'm using it and it is a little bit tinted as it says I think mm, yeah so this is a little bit tinted moisturized uh, tinted sunscreen so on top of it I use this so this is and again the eye cream is the same the second time around this is the same uh, Sicily eye and lip contour balm okay now for okay the second thing is if I am I have to go someplace and I am in a rush so I usually skip this and I just use the uh, the Tarte BB tinted treatment with SPF 30 and this is the shade uh, this is the shade in tan uh, and I think uh, everybody has seen um, as it, um, this is the shade this is and this is pretty much very very good color match for my skin tone and it is it is just a treatment like you are rushing you are on a go you just slap it on your face and you are good to go so for me and for my oily skin this is this is great so if I am on in a rush so I just slap this on and I'm good to go next okay in the night time if I am not uh, if I don't have any makeup on I just uh, wash my face with purity cleanser and use the nighttime moisturizers and all but if I do have makeup on I usually use any cleanser uh, sorry oil based cleansers in the night like um, this one is the currently I'm using this is the Tatcha pure um, one step Camille, um, sorry, um, Camellia uh, cleansing oil this is the current one I'm using and but I have used this is what the one I have stocked up on uh, this is this is the one from Josie Marin cleansing oil I have used this one before and this is my second bottle I will open it once my Tatcha uh, cleansing oil win will I will finish this one up and this is 
just great and this is what it says is just one step you just do uh, you just use it three four pumps on your uh, dry face and just rub it around your eyes and your face your lips and it's just clear in one step although when I use this usually uh, my uh, I use my inner eyelids and uh, one uh, one more time and after and after that I use the Tatcha uh, deep rise enzyme powder on top of this after this treatment I do it just to make sure that I have I have nothing left with regard to makeup on my face and this as you all know this is just uh, an enzyme powder on your uh, when you have cleared um, sorry uh, when you have washed your face don't wipe it off just use this powder and on uh, rub it around your wet hands and your wet face so it turns into a cleanser and which is very very gentle on your face it's not going to rub around like very harsh like some of the exfoliating cleansers do it's just cleanse your face and your face is neat and tidy it doesn't feel tight on my face it's more not I can say hydrating but it's it's gentle enough it doesn't dry out my face so after that I switch around in two um, I'm using right now um, retinol cream of 0 0.05 retinoin um, this just for uh, what do you call it a retinol for your face every day you have to use it and the second thing I am currently rotating it every every other day with the Sunday Riley Good Jeans treatment. This one I can say that previously I had like around my nose around this I have small small bumps you can say which are not going away even though you exfoliate your face you are very good to your body they were not going away so I thought like it's just my facial structure but as I have you start using this and this has been using I think for from August also so I have used just this much and more than I, I believe more than 50% is still left in it and this just you just use it this much see that's it not actually this is also more this not this much and just rub it around your face and that's it you're good to go and after a month when I started using it I suddenly noticed that I don't have that um, what do you call it um, a very rough texture around my nose I don't have that stubs coming out not that it has um, blackheads or something but there was a rough texture around my nose and this face and this here which were not going away previously but after I using this it has because it has lactic acid in it it was using the, the, those enzymes were basically dissolving that uh, gunk out of my face I can I presume so that and I have started using the retinol cream as well so probably these two saved my face and uh, last but not the least uh, the night cream I've been using again the Sisley this one is more uh, this is this uh, eye contour cream the morning one I use the gel cream this one is in the cream form like this so see this one is also the same not a dent I have been using it for quite a while these are very very emollient creams and I just pat it around my eyes over on top and down and just good to go it just settles pretty quickly and pretty nicely without giving me any waiting time or something uh, one more thing I am missing I think uh, okay the lip creams the lip balms I have I've been usually switch around these two in the mornings this is the Jack Black lip balm in uh, lemon and chamomile I don't uh, feel that they have very much smell uh, around of chamomile or lemon in them excuse me uh, but it has SPF 25 and 
this is the most not should I I should not say the thickest lip cream but this is the most no this is the lip balm which stays on my lips the most um, when I use this this is the Maybelline baby lips this has SPF of 20 this is very thin and not that this is very thick but you use it very little on your lips and it stays on your lips for my personal uh, opinion it stays on my lips pretty much the whole day I don't feel the need to use a lipstick on top it feels just amazing for this if I'm using this um, I kind of reapply this pretty much three four hours after so in the mornings I use between these two and in the night time I use the Tatcha uh, Gold uh, Camellia Nourishing Lip Balm and this is a very this is not a thick but this is this comes in a jar and this is pretty much uh, what I use for the night time and then I'm good to go um, so these are uh, I'll link I'll try to put everything uh, whatever I uh, said in the video in the description box and uh, provide you the, with the links where I bought it from but otherwise if you guys have any questions or have any uh, the requests for me to do the video please go ahead and uh, feel free to put that in the comments below um, so rest thank you for watching and rest I'll see in the next video thank you